All right, crack a book. I'm gonna crack you open for a, a pump shotgun schematic or a baseball bat schematic. What's up, zombie slayers? This is KG48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Seven Days to Die Alpha 18. Oh my god. Okay, you guys haven't missed anything. I came home, or you haven't missed much. Um, I came home after that little bit of uh, building over there at my horde base. And we're going to be doing a lot more building, but not today. I think this video is going to be a loot run video. And I, you know, I really kind of want to do loot runs, just straight up loot runs. But I got to continue doing quests, man. Like, for real. So, I think we're going to continue doing quests. I think... Oh, look at that. That's really close. Tier 3. Oh, okay. All right. So, we're going to do a Tier 3 quest tomorrow. Oh, that's right by, down by my horde base. That's right. I remember seeing that when I was coming up here. Um, did I just see a blue bag? I thought I saw a blue bag down here somewhere. Like, I actually died. Which, I haven't. Um, yeah, there you go. Enemy kills, player kills, and deaths. Level 20! All right, so here's the deal, guys. I came down here, and I made a little entranceway. Um, very basic, with just a couple hatches. All right, and that hopefully will keep the zombies out. And I came over here, and I put down some spikes. Uh, you might be wondering why I'm putting so much defense in this base. I mean, one would argue this base is more defensible than my horde base. And it's true. Um, my horde base will eventually be more defensible, but I need to guard myself against screamers, okay? Because I want to start getting some more forges up. I want to get all three forges going. Um, so I have got to uh, deal with the whole screamer issue. I'm also going to put walls around this area and maybe make a farm over here or something. I don't know. I'm going to think about that. This is all stuff I do not want to dig out. Although you don't really dig out farms anymore. They're blocks. So I could put them on a block and have it elevated. So I will probably do that. And this is going to be a farm. Now the thing that sucks is these blocks are all half blocks. And I can't stand when they build at half blocks and prefabs. It drives me nuts. Because you can see right here, the spikes are not directly... Um, against the walls, which just... Uh. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to break these uh, walls down and replace them. Not today, not tomorrow. Probably when I get an auger. And um, that will be it. Now, how far is this going to come out? So it's a second block out. All right, so I'm going to do that eventually at some point. You guys won't have to sit through it. And I ran out of spikes. So I'm going to go do some harvesting um, during the night. Some uh, some nighttime harvesting should be a lot of fun. I am live on Twitch. I uh, turned off all the bells and whistles and all that good stuff. But um, yeah. Oh, now see, I, this came out too far. Wait, but this comes in directly. See, they didn't even build these accurate. Okay, so this this half wall right here, this half wall right here is one, two, two full blocks in between the building and the wall, right? And this over here is one block in between the building and the wall. What is going on, people? Come on, symmetry. Symmetry! Ugh. Well, I'm just guess I'm just gonna go with it, but that's <clears throat> no like. Me no like. Anyway, um, yeah, let me, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do some uh, nighttime harvesting. I probably record it just in case anything crazy happens. I'm not, like, could you imagine if I died on this world and you guys didn't get to see it? No, I don't think that's gonna work for me. So I'm gonna record it. If I die, you'll see it. If I don't, I'll just delete the recording. So, um, yeah, it should be good. And in the morning, we will go do uh, some questing. Should be a lot of fun, guys. See you then. All right, guys. So I, you know, finished up in the mine, came back, did all the little, you know, things I needed to do it back at base. And I got to remember to come to the trader like every single day and buy the canned food because I'm actually out of canned food and I don't want to do any farming or anything like that right now. Um, so I got to make sure I restock on food pretty, pretty often. And while I'm here, he did just, re he just, he just restocked. I was going to do this off camera, but man, if I find that baseball bat, I want you guys to be here with me. Uh, boy, you have, like, nothing, dude. Jesus. Holy moly. Um, da, 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 da. I should probably buy some of this stuff. I'm going to buy eggs. I'll buy eggs if I see any. Um, I will buy honey. Um, well, should I? Nah, I'm going to hold off on honey. I don't have the, the, the recipe that that would take advantage of, whatever that recipe was called. Um, now here's some things I might want to buy. I need tripwire. I need... I don't need motion sensors. I don't really... I mean, I could use spotlights. That's expensive, though. I'm not going to buy that. Um, electric wire relay. It's kind of expensive, too. I'll be able to make that stuff eventually, so shouldn't be too much of a problem right now. Uh, hmm. You know, I don't have enough for it. Even if I did, like, I don't know. Maybe if it was steel. <laughs> uh, no. Uh, no. Don't care. Barbed wire mod. I should probably buy that. Why do I keep talking like this? Um, 
yeah, that's pretty pretty much a no-brainer. Oh boy. I already have the Grave Digger one. I don't need, I'm not gonna do anything military fiber. Extended magazine schematic. I can't I can't afford it and I'm gonna buy it. Um uh, scrap iron military leg armor. Night Stalker. Not something I'm gonna buy right now. Uh bladed weapons. Yeah, I don't I don't use bladed weapons and I don't do much at night either. Safe travels. Alright. All right. Now, you guys in the comment section have been giving me uh, locations to other traders. Um, I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. I read those at work, and by the time I get home, I completely forget. Um, so, <laughs> I don't know how... You guys are doing your job. I just have to get the locations of them. I do want to find more traders. Um, I did take the Burning Shaft mod out of the uh, club because it's very distracting when it's on fire. And I kind of like the uh, barbed wire one more. It looks kind of awesome. Um, what did it actually say on it for the barbed wire mod? 20% chance to bleed, 40% chance to power attacks. Okay. And it does up the damage. That's, yeah, that's a good mod. That is a hella good mod. All right, guys. Let's see what this one's got. Yeah, the, the food in these things have been... Um, they definitely nerfed them after they first were put in. But, you know, that's all right. I'm going to have to just keep a lookout for more... Uh, I should probably mark... You know, guys, when I find these these um, vending machines, I should mark them on the map. Not, not only the ones of traders, but... All right, let's see what this guy's got really quick. Uh, da, 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 da. don't care about any of that stuff. Mm, cobblestone I will buy. Cement's probably decent to buy as well, but not at that cost right now. I'm a little bit early in the game for that. I need to bring stuff to sell, too. I should have brought stuff to sell. That was a mistake. Um, okay. Freaking zombie, shut up. Where are the baseball bat to piece of crap? Um, what is can Is that five? Oh, ten stamina for thirty-eight. Yeah, I'll do that. Usually, he sells food for more expensive than it is in the vending machine, so you don't usually want to buy food from him. But that was pretty cheap. Uh, oh, yeah, you do need an anvil schematic, apparently. Uh, Shaka Messiah targets at three meters have higher this targets within three meters. Oh, okay. All right, definitely. Um, I already have that one. Could you imagine if I get all the books with the Shaka Messiah? Could you imagine me getting all the Shaka Messiah books before I found a damn shotgun schematic? Like, balance! <laughs> I don't know. I have a hard time with it. I don't think... I, no, I definitely found the pump shotgun schematic last season. But it seems really rare. And the baseball bat schematic, forget it. I don't think I saw one last season. Although maybe I did not I just forgot. Um, I'd really like to get that motorcycle chassis, but, you know... Oh, he doesn't have anything else? You suck. Why do you suck? Volume schematic. Okay. Alright, let's go do some quests. Alright, guys, and here we are at... Uh... What is that? A crack, crack a book, store more, munches, carpet, and dicks. Just dicks. That's all we got here, guys. Just dicks. Alright, so look at this. I got 848 casino tokens. What up, casino tokens? Let's do this. So I was talking to people in Twitch chat, right? And they were mentioning, like, some people are new to the game. Some guy just came here from the PS4 version, which I think is just awesome. And I was thinking, like, about these POIs. Like, what other game do you get these kind of POIs? Like, think about it. Like, what survival game? Right? I mean, Ark doesn't have POIs. I mean, where they have, like, caves and stuff, I guess. But no POIs, right? Um, like, what, Rust doesn't have POIs. Like, what game, what survival games have POIs, like, at all, first of all? And even the ones that do have POIs. Like, think about these POIs. These are literally dungeon crawls. Like, we, we've all been playing, everyone I'm talking to right now, most of you guys, we've all been playing Seven Days to Die for years, right? Or maybe you just started, like, six months ago, but we've been playing for a while, right? And, like, for me personally, I forget, you know? Like, I'm always like, like, oh, I want this, or I want that, or this needs to be fixed, or whatever. And that's just, you know, being in the moment and seeing things that I think they could do better. And, um, like, when I step back and think about it, the, the POIs in this game are literal dungeon crawls. And are, like, could you imagine you got a work that goes into this stuff? I mean, I know that, I know, I know Mad Mole wasn't sitting there designing POIs, but they had to have someone do it, right? I mean, the amount of work that that goes into his POIs are just are just amazing, and there's a lot of them, dude. I just did one like two a couple of videos ago I've never seen before, right? I mean, it's just awesome. I really really appreciate this game. It's the best survival game out there. I mean, that's not even a discussion. Unless you like um, unless you like uh, PVP, then I could see maybe this game. You know, maybe there's some out there that are better. Uh, but for pure PVE co-op single player, phew, forget it. I mean, this is it. 
This is it. And in my personal opinion, everyone's in a different situation, but in my personal opinion, this game is very worth getting a computer for. Um, <laughs> I mean, the console version's good, but, you know, this, this is where it's at, right? I'm getting a lot of food here, so that's cool. Good. Very good. Oh, these people. I mean, this is sick. Like, I can't think. Maybe maybe people will let me know in the comments section. Um, some other games do POIs like this. Because when I, when I ask people, what's a game like Seven Days to Die? There's really... I mean, there's games that are kind of like Seven Days to Die, but there's nothing that really does it the way Seven Days to Die does. Like, like look at Conan Exiles. Um, I haven't played Conan Exiles in a, in a bit, but I did play when they introduced their base defense mechanic, and it was it was bad. It was, I mean, it was just bad. <laughs> you know what? I like that potato. I feel like I should keep that potato. I think I have one at home already, though. But if I don't... Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep that stuff. I'm gonna keep that stuff, and we'll just do more drop chests. Anyway, um, yeah, Conan Exiles tried the whole zombie based defense thing, and they, they, they it was, it was awful. <laughs> it was awful. Um, I don't know. Maybe they fixed it since then. It sounded cool, but what they actually had was not that good. Like, uh, like, and when I mean not that good, I'm being generous. Is that the door that I just tried to open up and it was locked? This is a much better way to get in there. Yeah, look at that. Old sneaky ninja cage, right? Alright, what you got for me? Wow, I'm getting a lot of freaking stew. That's nice because I'm, I'm not looking good on the food right now. You know what? I don't want this to break in the middle of a fight, so let's just repair it right now. Okay, anything up there? Nope. Oh, that <laughs> I didn't have to break through the window, right? The other window was open. Is this where I'm supposed to go? No, it's a door that was locked on the other side. It's weird that that window was open. A little misleading. Come on, I know these freaking vultures are out here somewhere. Hmm. Or not. Oh, I remember this room. Oh, this floor is made of lava! No, it's not. Guy's falling out of the ceiling. Floor's fine. I need these guys to start getting stunned. You know what I mean? That's the problem. They don't get stunned. Now, where the hell am I going to put this point? Um, first of all, I should not be wearing nerd glasses in here. And I don't have the other glasses. Oh, that was a mistake. I got the ski goggles. That's agility. I need the shades. Damn it. See, I don't have shades with me. That's stupid. That's just stupid. Okay, so should I put a point in a better bartering? Or should I start building up my melee ability? Um, boy. <laughs> I have no freaking clue. That is such a hard decision. Alright, so after talking to chat in Twitch, I'm going to go Pummel Pete. Okay, are we falling through the floor, anybody? Oh boy. Oh boy. You scared me. Oops, we're going to miss. Pummel Pete ain't going to do you no good if you can't hit the zombies. Yeah, I just feel like this club is kind of weak, man. I really want that baseball bat. Ugh. I thought there's something in the middle. It's probably in another area. Ah! Oh, I hate that! <laughs> scares the crap out of me every time. Really? Oh, I got to get that from the other side. Yeah, I think Sex Rex would be another one as well. Um, can I put... Yeah, I'm gonna... Oh, I can actually do Sex Rex next. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Okay, nothing there. And we got one right here. Gonna loot all those cabinets, man. I need that food. I need that sweet, sweet canned food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So go down here next. Go through this a little bit faster. Hello, zombies. Where are all the zombies? I didn't just run past any zombies, seriously. I just thought they were going to be following me. Wow, okay. Holy jeebus. Get that off the screen. Alright, fair enough. Oh, oh! Oh, there he 
this! A little sneaky sneak. Okay, so here's the thing I want. I don't know if I talked about this on video. I probably have. I'm gonna mention it again. Can we please get a way to change colors of the uh, of the um, the crosshairs? For the love of God, uh, that's better than it both ways, right? Four, four, eleven, fifteen, twenty-one. Yep. Too bad it's red. Well, I could take that out. Yeah, let's take that out. I don't want it to be red. Oh, right, actually, you know what? It's different. Let's leave it. All right. Eat that. Hold on to the rest of that. I'm going to drink that. I'm going to eat that. I'm going to throw out water because I don't drink water like a commoner. Alright. Let's see what we got in here. Working stiff tools. Be good to me. That's not good to me. I said be good to me, damn it. Didn't you hear me? Padded, huh? Scrap that crap. Scrap that crap, bro. Uh, uh, yeah, I take the rotten flesh. I am eventually gonna farm. Really? Press E to pick up. Oh, you could pick it up? Oh, I'm gonna save that for my house. Can you make those? Did I spell it right? No, I didn't. It's two R's. No, you can't make that. Cool. So I just got something you can't make. I'll take that back and put it at my base. Because that's what's important in a zombie apocalypse. Having cool looking chairs. Aye. Aye. Is that open? That is not open. Does that go into the next room I'm supposed to go in anyway? No, that's the same. No, oh, yeah, that is the same door. Same door. I think I'm just gonna scrap that wrench. <clears throat> I could use the iron. Uh, scrap. I can, get, I can get murky water. I need to be mess up with my inventory to hold murky water, right? I don't need that nitrate. I can get more somewhere else. Um... I do want the seeds. I want to make blueberry seeds. Oh, you need like four blueberries to make some seeds, right? So I can't one blueberry. is kind of pointless. Same thing with potatoes. Although, how else are you going to save up the seeds, right? Yeah. All right, I'm just going to take them with me to hell with it. To hell with it. Make the seeds. All right. How many hit points does this thing have? All right. I'm going to do a drop chest. All right. And we are back, and I am all... I don't know what you would call it. Lightened up with all the stuff I put in my drop chest. And we're going to continue looting this place. Chairs. Someone asked why I don't, like, take... Like, break something else because it gives you wood, but you pick up chairs. Well, picking up chairs is instant, that's why. Um, it's just so fast, right? Fires Almanac. All right. All conditions and extreme temperatures are given. Oh, okay, cool. I like that. Did I miss any loot? I feel like I missed loot. Alright, whatever. I'm sure you guys let me know in the comments. Okay. Oh, boy. Got someone in there. Cling! 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 Shotgun aside, dude. Give me a freaking pump shotgun, you son of a biscuit. Can you hear me hitting my, my keyboard with extreme prejudice? Rage. <laughs> well, my damn shotgun already. Have I passed any of these cobblestone things? I don't think I have, but... Uh, well, there's some here, obviously, but I mean, before this room. There's only a couple here, so I'll just go ahead and dig these up. doop a doop a doop a doop Oh, I thought that was the way I was supposed to go, but I guess not. Thought there would be a ladder going up there or something. Ooh, is that better what I got? It is not. Jesus, why do I keep rhyming? Stop that. <laughs> that wasn't a rhyme. Um, I'm going to go ahead and scrap that. I was thinking about selling it, but I don't want to waste a repair kit on it. 
My repair kits are um, starting to really become a problem. And I could always use the iron. All right, crack a book. I'm going to crack you open for a, a pump shotgun schematic or a baseball bat schematic. Here we go. This is where I want to be. Pump shotgun schematic or baseball bat schematic. Please. Please, please, please. Ooh. That is no joke. All right. Let's see if we can take it without the turret. Whoop. Not off to a good start. Oh, he's enraged. He's enraged. Unfortunately for him, I'm permanently enraged. What the fudge are you doing, idiot? Cling! Cling! <laughs> so sweet. So sweet. Two of the same book. Do 10% of damage. Two of the same book and the same freaking thing. Or was that volume one and two? No, never mind. Wow. It's still two of the same book in the... I don't know the one I just read. But it, this isn't opened up now. 10% of damage to wolves. That's so weird. That, what was that like? Was that like volume one and two? Which one was that? The Hunters. Oh, no. It was volume uh, six and two. That's so weird to find two of the same bookcase, though. Come on. It's not a bad thing to find. Not really what I'm looking for, though. Ugh. Use no stamina while sneak sprinting. Oh, go to hell. Ugh. It's just no good. It's just, it's no good. Some more up here. We good? We good. Hey, what that register ever do to you? Oh, damn, woman. That looked really cool until she fell into the into the cabinet. All right. Keep your fingers crossed. When sneaking, you... Oh. When sneaking, you always land sound... Ugh, I can't even read it because I, I could not care less. It is impossible for me to care any less... Oh, that's a good one. I, is that stone? Bunker Buster stone, right? Okay, so I would prefer the iron one, but that's still a good one. Not great, but good. Now that, that, my friends, is a great find. No freaking joke. That is an unbelievably good find. It's not top tier. You got, like, baseball bat and shotgun up here, but that's right below it. I mean, that's a good find. Come on, come on, come on. Loot, 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 loot. You fall, loot faster. still nice to find it in a, in a bag like that. Usually you don't get anything good in those bags. Alright, let's keep on keeping on. Be able to jump on this. There we go. Scrap, 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 throw that out, 
We use the sham sandwiches for our moldy bread. I don't think I made one moldy bread all last season. Stupid things. What's the hit points on these? Do I care enough? You know, I probably don't. No. Screw this. Get this damn thing out of my way. Oh boy. That was a, the sneeze that never came. But it could have come, and I'm sure you wouldn't have wanted to listen to it. What's behind this thing? Something good or. Oh, okay. Me likey. Yeah, let's give her this lead. What do you got? You know, this would be a really nice find if I didn't already have one, so I'm not going to complain about that. Get this stupid thing out of the way. Oh! Okay. Well, this will be the last box we loot for this episode. Shotgun Messiah, come on! Shotgun! Pump shotgun! Do it! Do it! Maybe the game got confused and thought I was asking for shotgun shells. Was I was I not clear enough or... I don't know. Anyway, guys, I am going to call this one here. If you haven't enjoyed the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.